hospital room and I just had my surgery this morning. Now it's like 11.15 at night. I don't know why I can't sleep. I'm not feeling well. It takes the pain medication a little while to kick into my system. I am able to swallow. Um, I thought I wasn't going to be able to, but I've eaten two plates of food from the cafeteria. Sorry, they were soft, soft meals. drain port in my neck right now um, I keep checking on it I have not seen the incision I guess the way my neck is they had to go they had to cut a little bit longer than usual it's just now starting to feel sore it wasn't sore before but it's just now starting to feel sore my voice is just a little bit off um, I'm not able to talk Sometimes when I have to cough, it's weird. I can't really. I, I am able to get something up, but uh, not that much. So I'm holding my phone with my arm right now, and it's getting a little difficult. So I'm gonna get off here. But I just wanted to show you everything from day one how I felt. Um, surgery was. Let me put the phone on. This is. I'll just be looking to show the talk. Um, it was really fast. I had never had anesthesia before. And I was breathe, I remember breathing into this gas mask and then I was out. And when I woke back up, it was, uh, it was all over. I kind of couldn't believe it. I was glad to be awake. But, um, yeah, so they did the job. I'm, I'm excited to talk to the doctor about it tomorrow. And see how everything went. I have a weird taste in my throat, like chemically taste. I wonder if it's like part of the cage I'm sort of breathing in. But, um, yeah, so I don't really. The TV's stuck. I can't get out of bed by myself. Absolutely not. I don't have my neck brace on right now. And, um,. I have to put it on when I get up and walk around. And I haven't done that yet. You know, I, I thought it would be unbearable. And, um, it's definitely more tolerable than I had expected. I mean, no joke, it sucks. But I, I think that not having all those extra bones in my neck and having some stability is really going to um, provide more benefits than than how I was living before in chronic pain. And uh, my arm's going numb and not being able to hold the gym. So hopefully I'm praying that my strength will come back and um, that I'll be a whole normal person again, minus the fusion. So um, that's all I have to say, I guess. I'm stuck here watching the History Channel. The nurses have been, or the staff has been bringing me my food and water. Guys, sorry, Jamie had to go home. His visiting hours are only 8 to 8, so he couldn't stay the night because of COVID. So hopefully he'll be here early in the morning. And uh, that's one of the rooms. Talk to you tomorrow.